Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Bridgewater Raritan is being brought to you by Princeton Orthopedic Associates and Total Rehabilitation in Sports Medicine. A tough game being played tonight. The Red Devils of Ridge High School with just one loss this season face the Bridgewater Raritan Panthers. Let's jump in. Ridge would jump out to an early lead in this one. Ten minutes into the game, they hold it 3-0 over the Panthers after these two beautiful goals from Georgia Pesto and Emma Whiteman. But Bridgewater would remain in it and would tie the game up at three after this shot from Maddie Bray. Assisted by Sadie Herman and Bridgewater would continue to take the lead. Ty Jankowski jukes down the field and makes the score 6-4 Panthers with a little under two minutes left to play in the first half. And at halftime, Bridgewater would lead 7-4 after this goal from Lizzie Escuduro. Second half, 11-30 to play and the Panthers lead by one. But number 17, Whiteman, again drives the middle and she would tie the game up at nine. And then with 5.30 on the clock, Bailey Aaron would put Ridge back on top the assist from Losher and the Red Devils take the lead. But Bridgewater is a team with a lot of fight in them. CJ Amster scores the game tying goal that would send us into overtime with the score 11 all around. But it wouldn't be a long one. 45 seconds in, it's Jankowski who drives the cage, the shot, and that's it folks. BR takes the 12-11 win in overtime over the Red Devils for their 11th win of the season. Jankowski had two goals and two assists for the Panthers tonight, and after the game, we caught up with her. In any kind of game situation when we realize how important it is to have the ball on offense, our main mentality is to just be patient and to just trust each other, and our coaches prepared us so well with that, and each and every day in practice we prepared, so I think at the end of the game, it just it worked really nicely. They were doubling me, so my mind was a little hectic, but I remembered to keep my composure, and my team was supporting me, they were helping me, and right when I ran in, I had the open lane, I just kind of shot it <laughs> and hope for the best. I would just say overall, we just have to keep working together up and down the field when it comes to offense and defense. Each and every day, we're learning something new to work on, so I think when we look at film, we just think about this game recap. We're just going to work on those little things. Want to see highlights and features from your favorite school? Jersey Sports Zone is entirely supported by our great sponsors. Email marketing at jerseysportszone.com to get your business in front of our loyal audience and highlights from your hometown.